Hey guys, Allison Dalbon here, Bosu Fitness Master Trainer. I'm here to show you four fun exercises that combine our Bosu Balance Trainer and kettlebells. So go ahead and grab a medium heavy kettlebell and let's get moving. Go ahead and place one foot on top of the Bosu, grab the kettlebell, and then find your way into a nice long lunge stance. I want you to think of your body as a long line from heel to head, and you should start to feel that foot wobble a little bit as it's trying to balance out. So let's get ready for our bent over row. Just drag that elbow back, exhale and pull. Keep it real close to the body. We're gonna go for six reps here. So three, good. Just two more. Last one here. I'm gonna ask you to find a little bit of balance and stand up on the bow soon. Good, I'm gonna turn to you. You can stay right there. And we're gonna find our way into rack position. So bring that kettlebell up. So the thumbs at collarbone and the elbows in at the ribs. From here, we're taking a nice, easy press overhead. Again, six quick reps. Exhale, drive it up. If you want more of a balance challenge, we can start shifting the weight into the opposite foot. Three more good ones here. Bicep comes to ear, keep that wrist nice and straight. Two more. Last one. Good, bringing it down. And then go ahead and bring that kettlebell to center. Center grip, right foot's gonna step off. And I want you just to split those feet. So you're gonna squat and squat over. We've got 12 of these. Sinking it down and right back up. Now squat it over. Down, up, down, over. Good, so chest stays up. You're getting nice and low. Kettlebell might tap the bow, so that's fine. And I want you to really press off both feet. We're halfway there. Keep breathing. This one's gonna get your heart rate up. Good. I need just four more here. You choose how much propulsion you give me as you come up and over. One more each side. On this last one, come up center balance. Now bring that kettlebell on the chest. I want you to come down one knee at a time. You're gonna turn side, you stay front. And we're coming down one knee at a time. Try to keep those toes from touching the ground. Let them if they need to. Recenter yourself. Now rip that kettlebell open. Drive the hips back. Squeeze and press them forward. Whew, feel that balance, drive them back. Squeeze and lift. So we're trying to get that nice flat back again. Abs are on every time you fold. And we're really activating the hamstrings. Give me four. Keep those toes up. Two. One more. Good, and we're gonna come back up. See if you can come up the same way you came down. One foot at a time. Good, we'll turn back to you. Just sit right where you're at. Get that kettlebell to the other side. We've got six presses. Just like last time, shift your weight if you want. A little extra balance challenge. Maybe just popping that heel. Full range again, not little rib. Bicep to ear, two more. One more. Good, and I want that same foot, left foot to go back. Find your way into a bent over row. Hand comes down. Back heels lifted, give me those six. Elbow back. Nice and close to the body, abs are tight. Long line from heel to head, give me three, two, one, and step it off, relax. Nice job, you guys. We've got our Bosu bent over row. We've got an overhead press on top of the Bosu our squat up and over, and then our kettlebell hinge from a kneeling position. 10 to 12 reps of each is gonna be great. You choose the round you do.